With the recent update 15.2 to macOS, we got multiple new features for Apple Intelligence. To be honest, that should be the version 1.0 on the release date, but we finally got those basics like image generation or integration with chat GPT. So how can we link our Apple Intelligence Siri with chat GPT? All right, simply head to your system settings at the bottom in the dock, and then scroll here on the left and search for Apple Intelligence. It's usually around the general settings, around the control center. Then you probably got this AI already on, but now we can scroll down here and there's a new option in extensions, all right? So we can expect many more in the future, but right now we can turn on chat GPT extension. Just click it and set up like that. You can even log into your existing account if you like to keep like the history. All right, let's turn it on. And as you can see, this toggle now it's on. So now Siri, Apple AI can use chat GPT for you. So you can simply use a regular type to Siri and she'll be able to check stuff in that AI. So we can ask her to, I ask her to generate a video description. And now I can see this toggle working with chat GPT. And here it is, I got this text generated here and there's kind of like the logo of the chat GPT at the bottom of it. And you can copy it straight from here. That's cool. Also, you can ask on the stuff that is directly on your screen. You can open the document and ask to summarize it without like copy and paste in between. So that's also a great feature. Keep in mind, I switch off this feature here, confirm requests. So every time when Siri or Apple AI want to use chat GPT, you will need to click OK, OK, OK. So I switch this off and I recommend that to you as well. By default, this will be on like that. If you switch it off, you just let her Siri use it, whatever she needs. You will see the logo of it, but you don't need to confirm again and again. All right. So that's how easy it is. And as I mentioned, you can even log into your existing account from here to maintain your history. All right, so that's how we link Apple Intelligent with ChatGPT in system settings over here. I hope this was helpful. See you in the next one.